Oscar-winning actress Natalie Portman has called method acting a luxury that women can't afford, adding that she's never used the technique. I've gotten very into roles, but I think it's honestly a luxury that women can't afford, she told the Wall Street Journal, Wall Street Journal, in an interview published Monday. I don't think that children or partners would be very understanding of, you know, me making everyone call me Jackie Kennedy all the time, a reference to the 2016 movie A Jackie, which follows the former first lady, played by Portman, in the wake of her husband's assassination. During the Wall Street Journal interview, Portman discussed her role in Todd Haynes' new movie A May December, in which she plays a fictional actress Elizabeth Berry, sent to shadow a woman with a sordid past in preparation for portraying her in a movie. Portman's no stranger to intensive preparation, undergoing five hours a day of grueling ballet training six days a week for several months for A Black Swan. However, she says she's never used method acting. The technique was founded by Russian theater director Konstantin Stanislavsky in the 1900s and further developed by legendary acting coach Lee Strasberg, according to the Lee Strasberg Theater and Film Institute. May December l to r Natalie Portman as Elizabeth Berry and Julianne Moore as Gracie Atherton you in May December. CR Francois Duhamel slash courtesy of Netflix. In May December, Natalie Portman undergoes an unsettling transformation. It encourages actors to use their physical, mental and emotional self to create a character while drawing on their own life experiences for the role, the institute adds, and provokes differing responses among actors as to its usefulness. Some actors including Jeremy Strong, Daniel Day-Lewis and Robert De Niro are known to have used the immersive technique which can see stars staying in character during a project. Female actors have used it too. In 2021, Lady Gaga told British Vogue that method acting helped her portray socialite Patricia Reggiani in the fashion biopic House of Gucci, for which she earned a Golden Globe nomination. However, other actors have expressed their reservations about the technique. Succession star Brian Cox told A Late Night with Seth Meyers in 2021 that he worried about his co-star Strong's approach to acting, because if you can't separate yourself, because you're dealing with all of this material every day, you can't live in it, eventually you get worn out. Meanwhile, Meryl Streep said she was so depressed, while using the technique to play Miranda Priestley in The Devil Wears Prada.